Hi my beauties, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you my skincare travel essentials bag. Basically, all the skincare essentials that I carry with me while I'm traveling. So I was packing for a weekend getaway. It's basically a three days getaway. So I thought, why not share this very important bag with you? Because this is going to have all the skincare that I like carrying with me. I don't know why I haven't done a video like this before but better late than never, right? I'm quickly gonna introduce you to the bag. It looks something like this. I personally love this bag as well. I picked it up off Amazon. It's not sponsored, I actually bought it. I love how many pockets there are in this and it has a lot of storage. So essentially, this is gonna fit my makeup because I don't like carrying a lot of makeup when I'm traveling. This is gonna have my skincare and also my body care. Now, if you are uh, parents to a toddler or to a kid, you would know that for parents of kids, you have to downsize your requirements to uh, whatever essentials there are because kids have a lot of luggage, uh, a lot of necessities for toddlers specifically. So my husband and I kind of try and uh, pack light, uh, at least we try for that. So skincare and hair care and whatever other essentials that I need go in a bag like this. Today I'm only going to be sharing my skincare essentials with you. If you do land up liking this video, leave me a comment and I'll make a separate video with other products that I carry in this bag. If you've been following me for a while, you would know I love anything which comes in travel size, minis. I'm not someone who likes to carry uh, bulky big bottles whenever I'm traveling. I feel that's uh, inefficient. Also, it becomes very clumsy. Uh, if you are specially hopping, like if you're living in Airbnbs, traveling international, it's a lot to pack and unpack. So I personally love to organize this in a much more efficient manner. That's what I'm going to be sharing with you in this video. Without further ado, let's dive right into this video. Before you do that, please take a moment to subscribe to the channel. Please make sure you've also hit the notification bell do also follow me on my Instagram and now let's dive right into it now before diving into the detail of this bag let me quickly give you a glimpse of how this bag looks like of course there are a lot of minis but I still feel there is still a lot of space for more skincare to come in but this is all that you will need to travel with now I am going to be reviewing these products briefly for you but if you want to know detailed reviews I'm pretty sure I must have reviewed most of these products in some of the other of my videos. I am going to try and link them right here in the eye or in the description box. Also if you want to know how to layer your skincare correctly I am going to leave most of the skincare routines that I've done right here in the eye or again you will find them in the description. I'm not going in any order but I'm just going to grab whatever comes in my hand and the first product that I grabbed is the DHC Deep Cleansing Oil. Such an amazing form it breaks down your sunscreen, oils, dirt and grime and even water resistant makeup so beautifully. I'm wearing a water resistant eyeliner today and I am pretty sure this is going to break that up very quickly. I have used one full bottle of this. Great product and look at the size of this. This is going to fit in any bag. It actually fits in my handbag very well too. If you're looking for a good one you can try this. Very little goes a long way but if you're looking for more affordable options I will link a few for you in the description. Then I want to introduce you to a very intelligently designed style starter pack for beginners and these are serums from Plum. It's called their specialist serum starter pack priced only at 690 rupees. I love how this is priced, super affordable and you get to try all of their five serums. You get 3 ml of each meaning you can get 8 to 10 uses out of each bottle and you do get a plethora of ingredients here. Basically now you will know how can I travel with this. Even if I'm traveling for up to 10 days this is more than enough and fulfills all of my skincare needs. First, let's talk about their vitamin C. Comes with ethyl ascorbic acid, a product that I love and have reviewed. If hyperpigmentation is your concern, if uneven skin tone is your concern, if you have acne scars, this is definitely a product you can look out for. Then I have the 2% hyaluronic acid, which comes with Bulgarian rose extract. If you have dry skin, if you have dehydrated skin, this is definitely a product you can try. Then I have the niacinamide, which comes with rice water extract and also squalane. A great product if you're looking for a good niacinamide, especially for dry skin. I have their retinol, which is formulated with bakuchi oil. Again, this is a great product. I have been testing this out and I am going to review this in a lot more detail in a few weeks. And then what I have here is an exfoliating serum from them. So I do use chemical exfoliation two to three times a week. And this one is actually a pretty good blend of AHA, BHA and PHA right here. Again, a product that I've been testing out since a couple of weeks and I will review it shortly. Overall, I feel this is a starter pack that I definitely 
definitely see myself traveling with very very often because this is going to fulfill most of my skincare needs. Now, if you're a beginner or new to skincare, really like how this reading guide can help you through. Basically, it has all the percentages of all the serums, the ingredients used, and they have very briefly explained all the serums here. Do go through this guide before you start testing these products out. I also really appreciate how they have helped you with a layering guide. So from Monday to Sunday, you know exactly what you can layer with in your AM and also in your PM routine. Let me introduce you to two of my favorite serums from the pack. The Plum Vitamin C comes with 15% ethyl ascorbic acid. It's a glow boosting formula. Vitamin C is a great antioxidant which is proven to work on dark spots, wrinkles and also hyperpigmentation. This one gives a soft glow in the long run. My second favorite is the Plum Rice Water and 10% Niacinamide. A great formulation for beginners as well. I love using a good niacinamide in my AM or PM routine as it targets dark spots. Acne scars, it also regulates sebum production and brightens and improves skin texture. All right, let's quickly dive in and see what are the other products I have in my skincare essentials travel kit. I have a face wash here. Of course, you need one for your AM and PM routine, something that's gentle, doesn't strip out your skin, and something that is good for your double cleansing method as well. This is something that I've used bottles of. It's gentle on the skin, doesn't make your skin feel stripped out, and I love how this comes in a travel size bottle, so it's a win-win for me. Then moving on to a toner. Now I carry two toners and I'll tell you the reason why. Firstly, I carry a cream toner because if I'm going to a colder destination, it's likely that my skin is going to feel a little bit different or maybe even dry than it normally is. I have combination skin, but it does change with weather. So I always keep a cream toner like this. This is from Laneige. I love this product and I love this comes in a travel size. Little bit goes a long way and it really hydrates your skin, especially if you're dry skin, you will love this. And then I also keep some sort of a spray toner. If I don't need a lot of hydration after washing my face, I do keep a backup something in the travel size. Now this I got as a tester from Kama Ayurveda and I also refill this every time I'm traveling. So I have enough to use while I'm traveling. Like if I'm going for a three day getaway, I will not need more than this. I also like spraying my face quite a lot, uh, especially in the summer season. I love misting my face. So a rose water always comes handy. So I keep a small bottle like rose water. If you don't have this because this was a tester, you can always always buy those small disposable bottles that you get on Amazon very easily and then you can fill your rose water in it and carry with you. They come in travel size. Then moving on, I am going to talk about a moisturizer. Of course, I try different moisturizers for my skin, but there's one moisturizer I love traveling with because this just leaves my skin well hydrated, not greasy. And I have this one from Clinique. It's their 100 hour auto replenishing moisturizer. Definitely comes in a travel size. I love this tub. It's more than enough for me, even if I travel for a good 10 days. My next product is an eye cream. This is from Pixi. It's the vitamin C under eye brightener. Now this is something I've been testing out since a few days and I don't want to break that chain. So I'm going to be carrying this with me. I anyway love using an eye cream in the day and the nighttime. I use this in the nighttime because I want to heal my under eye dark circles and bags and that's also the time when my skin is actually going to be healing so I love how travel friendly this is also a side note if I'm testing any products out in that duration although I like to plan my travel in a way and also my skincare trials that I'm not trying anything in that period but if I am because it's a professional hazard then I have to carry that skincare with me if this one performs well this is definitely traveling with me to many other places come on look at the size of this this is going to fit into just about anything then moving on to a skincare essential that I'm guilty of carrying extra off and I'm talking about sunscreen. It's just that I never want to run out of sunscreen even though if I do run out of sunscreen I'm pretty sure I will be able to get my hands on some of the other sunscreen wherever I travel but somehow I just land up traveling with a little bit of extra sunscreen. I guess that never hurts right? Now I have two tubes here. To my defense both of these are tiny tubes so I guess we can fit these in. The first one is the Neutrogena Dry Touch Sunscreen. It's an ultra lightweight sunscreen. It uh, does doesn't sit on top of the skin, gets absorbed easily, doesn't leave a white cast, has a great uh, PA rating. You also get good sun protection factor here. Good sunscreen to travel with. I had a new tube, so I'm traveling with it. And I have very little left of this, but I totally love this sunscreen. This is the Dr. Shed Ceramide and Vitamin C sunscreen. I have reviewed this. I have very little left of this. I have to repurchase this. But in the meanwhile, I'm going to be carrying this as well. Another skincare essential that I never leave behind. I always uh, travel with this. This works as a lip balm. If I I have chapped uh, heels or chapped knees or elbows if I feel dry anywhere or flaky anywhere um, I can use this I have 
the Vaseline Petroleum Jelly. Such a humble product, but such an amazing product. This always goes in my travel bag. Last few essentials that go in my travel kit, a hand cream, this is from Bath & Body Works, it's called Hello Beautiful, has a beautiful fragrance to it and very lightweight. I have to moisturize my hands every time I wash them, so one goes in my handbag, the other one in my travel essentials kit. And lastly, I have some wipes and these are makeup removing wipes, like these are reusable wipes, so whenever you do double cleanse, you just squeeze these out of some water and wipe your face. You can of course reuse them many, many times. Great quality from Earth Rhythm and this one is from One earth both of these i love i've used so many of these and i keep repurchasing these great quality like i said and then i also have some cotton wipes in case i have very little makeup to remove or just break down my sunscreen i will go ahead with something like this with that it's a wrap guys if you want to see more of these videos like what's in my bag what's in my body care bag or makeup bag or anything of that sort please feel free to leave it in the comments section i'll be more than happy to film it for you until i see you next guys thank you so much for watching love you all Bye-bye.